Praise the Lord. I greet all of you in the name of Jesus Christ. This is going to be a beautiful day. And this day you can expect to experience God's grace and God's love in a new way. There was a lawyer who came to Jesus. He wanted to know what he should do in order to inherit eternal life. And Jesus told him, if you really want eternal life, obey all the commandments. What do these commandments say? And how do you read it? And to this the lawyer replied, God is one. And love the Lord with all of your heart, and with all of your mind, and with all of your strength, and with all of your understanding. And Jesus said, you go and do these things. And the lawyer wanted to justify himself. So he said, who is my neighbor? And he thought he was smart. And he did not know what the answer of Jesus Christ would be. And Jesus gave him the best definition of neighbor. And Jesus, instead of directly telling him, he told a story. And that is the story recorded in the book of Luke, chapter 10. The story of a good Samaritan. And in that story, he answered who the real neighbor is. At the end of the story, Jesus asked, now who do you think was a good neighbor to this man who was suffering, whom the good Samaritan helped? And the lawyer said, of course, the man who helped this suffering man. And Jesus told him, go and do likewise. We are called to love our neighbor as we love ourselves. Now to this question, I do not know what your answer will be. Who is my neighbor? But the definition of Jesus Christ as to who our neighbor is, is the best. Someone whom we meet along the way, perhaps for the first time, who is desperate and desperately looking for someone to come and help him in his situation. And if we meet someone, treat him as our neighbor whom God is providing today to show kindness. So will you be a good neighbor to someone who may meet perhaps for the first time? But that first time meeting of this man who is in desperate need gives you an opportunity to show the love of God. So be a good neighbor to someone who needs you and your help. You shall be blessed. God bless you and have a good day.